Uh, there there is. you go. <laughs> Okay, so probably he's now there. Yeah. Yeah, yeah he was listening to you. He was listening to you. Good so morning. That... <laughs> Good morning. Good morning. Good. Yeah, yeah. yeah. What, what, what were you guys talking about? In the time wake up. <laughs> what time is it? 8.08? Oh man. It's a... I'm sorry about the, my cellular says 801. Oh my god, I'm sorry. That was a mistake in my I was surprised. I'm a wow, everybody's connected on time. All right. How are you? How was your day today? Everything good? Hello? And finally, it's Friday. Friday, it's coming tomorrow. Yeah, tomorrow on Friday. Yes. Cool. Can you hear me? Yes. Yeah. Okay, great. Thank you. So what's uh, um, everything okay? How are you? Fine. Good. Waiting, waiting for the weekend. You know, I, I don't know. But was there a lot of traffic today? Yes. In those chorros. Well, normally in those chorros. Yeah, I mean, that's, that's, that's always. Yes. Los chorros is normal that there's traffic. I spent, I think I spent maybe one hour. Today. And, uh, and we had in, in your student for today? Uh, let me check. Hold on, please. Um, yeah. Stay to class. I'm sorry. <laughs> Yeah. Okay, so remember it. so remember yesterday we were doing um we were doing in the meantime while and when. Who can explain to me what's the difference between while and when? Well when the two 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 situations happening in the same in the same time. Okay. And the same, and the same time. And the, Ways in interrupting the interrupt the Hello. Uh -huh. Hello, hi. Hello. Hey, hey, hey David, you, you, you need to speak with the with the with, with the, the neighbor. <laughs> with my neighbor. <laughs> <laughs> the neighbor. They must say that you're using the neighbor. The neighbor. The neighbor. The neighbor. <laughs> no, you know. For <laughs> say. Yeah. <laughs> no, it's know, a bad neighbor. It's a bad neighbor. Yeah, it's a bad neighbor. Huh? <laughs> Let me open the door. I have a repetidor. <laughs> uh, <laughs> no, because um, when I teach, I this is a desktop, so I'm way in the back. So I have a repetidor, which supposedly gets the connection from my router. And I am mm -hmm. seeing here. I am seeing here that the connection is from my router in the living room, not not my repetidor. Uh, 
Oh. So that's why that's why and and but you know what? It's it's very good um reach because man, there's like one, two, three doors and uh and a wall and they still get reception. So it's good. All the time all the time happen when you are you are used the, the connection of the neighbor, no? oh, the neighbor. <laughs> <laughs> Oh man, something terrible happened to me today. What happened to you today? Hello. My hamsters died. You you have you had you, hamsters? You hamsters? Yeah. <laughs> yeah, I I I didn't want them. That but, is um, terrible for your son. No, you know, actually he he, he liked them. The the problem was that um it my niece, she actually had them and she liked them and it, you know, and then, but one hamster became pregnant and, and then she was oh. crying and, you know, so I said, okay, give me two. And, you know, when you come over, you can play with them. So she was very happy. The thing is that one, one of those hamsters, he escaped from his, from his, it was like a box. And, um, He's gone. Hello. <laughs> Hello. I'm sorry, can you hear me now? Yeah. Yes. Yes. Yeah. Okay, I'm sorry. So. Uh, to yeah. improve the <laughs> I, I need to go speak with my neighbor now. Like what the hell? <laughs> <laughs> what are you thinking? Yeah. No, no, my apologies. I'm sorry. I and it was fine. I mean, I always usually I am on my desk 30 minutes before and I now I have the call. Oh no, but Claro closes at seven, huh? <laughs> <laughs> okay, well, let's do this like that. Well, anyway, so so then the hamsters they escape from their um from the little box. Mm -hmm. And we we were looking for them and we never found them. And mm -hmm. they actually went into my dryer. The dryer? In your dryer. <laughs> yes, in, in the it's bottom cooking hamster. <laughs> oh my god, it was so sad. Be but I mean, this happened. I mean, I imagine they must have died Monday, or I don't know. It's the last time we washed clothes. But you know the smell, like oh my god, that's the smell of a dead oh rat. God. You're dead, right? And we couldn't <laughs> find it. <laughs> and I look at the bottom of the dryer and opened it, and they were there, like like they look like skeletons. Can you imagine what a way to die? Well, I, I feel so I feel so terrible. <laughs> That's not a way to die. <laughs> Teacher, um, yes, I had heard that those animal hunter they die in very weird ways. Because I have had uh, one and he got lost. Well, I don't know where he goes. He went. And till this day, I haven't found it. <laughs> yeah, that's what I heard. That they they're very um, mischievous. You know mm -hmm. what mischievous is? <laughs> yes. And they escape yeah. everywhere. You know, so yeah. Then th maybe they they die in strange ways because they're bad. They're bad. <laughs> mm -hmm. 
All right. Um, so it's sad. I don't know. I don't know what to tell my niece. That yeah, they escape. Yeah, I'm, uh, yeah. That's what I told her so escape. far. Because now that I found out, I'm not gonna tell her. Hey, you know what, baby? They they died like in the Holocaust or something. <laughs> <laughs> That's so terrible. Uh, you're right. Yeah, so I'll just say they escaped. Right. They escaped. Hussein, hi. Mischievous Travesia. Thank you, Jordana. Oh, I remember oh, Jordana I is always. Jordana is always in Google. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. hey, hey, hey. I forgot that. Google we'll translation. Yeah. Little translation. There you go. Okay. Okay. So let me share the screen so we can continue. Meanwhile. What... Meanwhile. <laughs> meanwhile. <laughs> meanwhile. Yes. Let me see. I'm sure the screen right now. Hold on, please. Okay. In the meantime, you are continuing the class. Yes. Why? Hold on. I, I'm I'm going to share the sound. Japanese people drive on the left. Can you hear? Use except that. Yes. Yes. Except yes. Or, and yes. except for the fact that to show an exception. Okay, so um, yesterday we were doing while and unlike. Um, what is unlike? I like when the two, two we compare the two different the different uh, uh, facts uh, uh, to compare two two situation is a, as a as a different. Yeah. Um, yes. Two, two, when you say unlike, yes, there's a big contrast. There's a totally opposite. Yes. Okay. Yeah, opposite. Like yeah. like let's say men and women are always total opposites in everything. Yes, women are always looking at other women's shoes. Yes, or unlike men, we don't look at other men's shoes. Correct? Mm -hmm. A diferencia de, okay. in Spanish. A diferencia de eso. No, it's not really a diferencia de, that would be most more like, no como. Ah. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yes. yes. Okay, like for example, um, Women, you know, women are always looking, oh, look at her dress, look at her shoes. Unlike men, we never say mm -hmm. that. We never we never talk about other men. Hey, look at his shoes. He <laughs> in no van con his shoes. Yeah. Yeah, we don't, we don't. Well, now, you know, with the new glass generation, there are some that do that. <laughs> but normally we don't say that. <laughs> So that um, and, you know, that's that's a big difference. Unlike, yes. Can you give me another example? Use uh, and uh, the example we have here. Unlike the Japanese, Italians seem to drink a lot of bottled water. Okay, can you compare something Americans do? Uh, uh, Americans do uh, that Salvadorians don't, or vice versa. Americans from the United States, of course. Um, like, mm. like the American, the Salvadorians seem to, to eat a, a lot of pupusas. <laughs> yeah, that's right. Let, let, me, let me give you an example. Yes, that's true. Unlike Salvadorians, American people respect traffic, mm. traffic signals. Traffic rules. 
traffic signals. Traffic uh -huh. signs. Not all of them, but in general, yeah. they do. Yes. Do you understand that? Unlike Salvadorians, Americans do respect the traffic signals. Yeah. Yeah. And yeah so, so what I'm saying in El Salvador, we don't. Right. You know, no. you know my, my brother, he was driving in Arizona. He told me he could not even see a car. Everything was a desert. He couldn't even see a car mm. for any distance. So he was in a red light. He was the only car there, the only car. So he said, oh, okay. He, so he turned right, he continued. The next day he got a $500 ticket with three pictures. <clears throat> The yeah, car. but hey, the, about, uh, about yeah, the, the camera. Car. Yeah. The car, the license plate, and a close up of his face. Okay. <laughs> and, I, and I say to myself, that's a very good idea. I mean, you know how the government, they're always trying to make money for some reason. Um, I don't know why transit police doesn't drive around and see all the cars that are parked wrong and just tow them. And, and you know, you have to pay a fine because you were parked wrong where they will make a lot of money, easy money. Yeah. So that's, did you understand the reason what I said, unlike Salvadorians, Americans do respect um, the traffic lights. Or I can say something positive about El Salvador. Unlike Americans, Salvadorians are really close with the family. Yes. Yes. In the United States, Americans, when you're 18, you leave the house and five, six, 10 years, and you don't see your parents anymore. You just call. And it's normal for them. OK? Um, Gio, mm -hmm. can you compare rock with reggaeton, please? Uh. <laughs> <laughs> um, oh, um, Gio, I, I'm sorry. I have to ask you. What do you think about Metallica with Jay Baldwin? I, I I don't want I don't want to talk about it no <laughs> because comments, right? man, that wow, that was a big hit. Gosh. <laughs> Gosh, I, I don't like at all that decision. Yeah, it was very stupid. <laughs> okay, but yeah. compare you 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 are a musician, so I don't know. Can you compare yeah. reggaeton and, and and rock music? Unlike unlike reggaeton, um, metal music musicians are very very I don't say uh, studied people, talented. Culture. Sorry, uh, talented yeah, people. Yeah, people. Because, yeah, there are astrophysics from uh, the, <laughs> the, the guitarist from Queen is astrophysics, and, and he teaches in a in a university. Yeah, the, the singer from Iron Maiden, he's everything. Yeah, and uh, do you remember that the guy from uh, this band? Uh, I don't remember, but he's uh, the Carcass. The, the the four guys from Carcass they are uh, medics. Really? Yeah. Wow. Yeah. The right the the singer from Iron Maiden he is uh ah yeah yeah he has like um, five five different things. Yeah, he's pilot. He's a pilot. Played, pilot. He has a yeah. masters he, in Egyptian history. He has yeah, business and administration. He, he won the the world uh, the, uh, the the Sgrima, Sgrima he's yeah. champion. Oh, yeah. He's a champion. The Sgrima, yeah. He's Can you champion. imagine that? Wow. Mm -hmm. And the reggaeton? Wow, unbelievable. And the reggaeton? No. <laughs> no. He got a lot of shoes. <laughs> yeah, they got they got a lot and of jewelry. shoes. And jewelry. And jewelry. Yes. Yeah. So that that was a very good example. So he says, unlike reggaeton singers. Metal singers, rock singers, I think while well, any other singer <laughs> are more creative or talented. 
Yeah. Even even Arjona is more talented. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> even, even Arjona. <laughs> All right. Uh, Ricardo, can you tell me uh, uh, just the last one with unlike the tortillas of San Miguel and San Salvador? Mm -hmm. <laughs> I like the tortilla. The, Wait, have the, you ever eaten the, tortillas San... in San Miguel? Yes, yes. Oh, okay, I, I am from San Miguel, yes. Oh, okay. Oh, yeah. 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 <laughs> yes. Aguila. Uh, <laughs> yes, <laughs> of course. <laughs> okay. I, I like the, the, the tortillas uh, in San Miguel. Uh, tortillas in San Salvador is more wide with, um, I, I don't know, it's a uh, gruesas. Uh, <laughs> What is the word he's looking for, class? It's a compare because the, 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 the tortillas in San Miguel is a, 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 a thing, a thing, a thing. Ah, it's yes. a, it's, the yes. San Salvador is a sick. Okay, yeah. Then? Yes. Okay. Um, Unlike the, the, the tortillas in San Miguel, the tortillas in San Salvador is sick. Are. Are they? Are, 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 are sick. Are sick. Okay, good. Um, I in the chat. Okay, thick is San Salvador, right? Thick. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. And thin, thin are San Miguel. San Miguel. Yeah. Okay. Yes. Okay, so that was a very good example. Unlike the tortillas in San Miguel, in San Salvador, the tortillas are very thick. So, you don't need to explain to us how the tortillas in San Miguel are, because you pretty much explain it right mm -hmm. there. So only a not so normal person would say, "Y cómo son los de San Miguel entonces?" <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I mean, you just said it. You you just said it um, hypothetically, you know. <laughs> Unlike the tortillas in San Miguel in San Salvador, tortillas are very thick. So de, obviously, San Salvador son gordita. <laughs> yes, I really like the tortillas in San Miguel. Yeah, me yes. too. Just, they're thin. You you can you can uh, are thin uh, and are big. <laughs> and they're big, yes. Yeah. I I like them because they're easier. I don't to like toast. tortillas in any place. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god, you don't like tortillas. You don't like tortillas. Oh man, I love tortillas. What about pupusas? Do you like pupusas? Yes, but it's, 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 it's better to, to taco. <laughs> if you don't like tortillas, you don't eat pupusas and either tacos. <laughs> yes. <laughs> well, actually, if you don't like tortillas, you, know? you, you maybe don't like a lot I of Salvadoran food. Bread. <laughs> yeah. Okay. Oh, and uh, Ricardo, in San Miguel, did, do you eat the, the curtido? I don't like Salvadorian. No, I cannot say I am not Salvatore. I, I, I couldn't oh, could hear yes. because it's a very noisy. To do. <laughs> oh, I'm sorry. Can you hear me? Um, do you eat the curtido with yes. mayonnaise? Ah, yes, yes. In the mayonnaise, in, in mayonnaise and, and a, 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 a black sauce, too. <laughs> Why you eat it like that? The sauce. Who are you to eat it like that? <laughs> no, but you know what? But it's good. Yes, no. yes, it's, it's a good. It's, it's San Miguel is it's normally the, the, it, it, the it's like eating, I mind. It's like campero salad, similar, something. I haven't yes, tasted yes. Hey, 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 I'm you, not, you, hey, uh, have you taste you taste uh, tortilla you? from from the La Pema? Fritos. Yes, apretadores. <laughs> yeah. Apretadores. <laughs> <laughs> let me see. Let me see if you if you are San Migueleño for real. Mm -hmm. Have you ever tried cocomal? What? Uh, only a, only a Migueleño would know this. Ricardo, have you ever tried cocomal? Cocomal, but I don't remember. I don't know. Cocomal. Oh. In, in, in Tienda Rosita, Refresco Rosita. 
Uh, <laughs> I promise you, San Miguel is so small that if I if you tell a Migueleño, hey, Tienda Rosita, they will know that store. Okay. It's like aquí, remember that um, La Tienda de la... Cachillo, remember what's the name of that Tienda for el... Uh, quick Pick? Internacional, el Colegio Do you remember the Quick Pick? Do you remember Capulinas? <laughs> yeah. I am. Yeah. The, no. the gas station. Yeah, in the gas station with the chickens. <laughs> Yeah. The do, do, you know, do you know the, the Puya, the Puya, Puya in San Miguel is a, a, the, a Puya soup? The yeah, Puya. Pata, Puya soup. Oh, sopa pata, sí, Puya. Yeah. No, Cocomal is, is, is oh. very good. I don't know why here in San Salvador, people are like, they don't invent that here. Okay, so you go to a place where they sell licuados, right? Yeah. So in, in San Miguel, you go to that place and they give you a bag with milk and cocoa, right, milk. And then in the milk, in the bag, they put cornflakes uh -huh. and bananas. Uh, yeah. uh -huh. Everything in a bag. <laughs> and they give you the bag with they the straw. It. Yeah, they shake it. Uh -huh. <laughs> so you drink it. So they give you the bag with the straw. So you drink it like a normal, and then they give you a spoon. So when you finish drinking it, you eat the cereal with the banana. Yeah. It was it was a very good idea. It was one dollar. It was a great breakfast. <laughs> that was the famous cocomal. Uh, and I said, uh, yeah. That, where did the name come from? I don't know because cocomal. I only tried it in San Miguel. I don't know why why people here uh -huh. in San Salvador don't invent that. Like, you know, they can every university has puestos de licuados. That would make yes. good money. Imagine that for breakfast. There's idea to make money. Yeah, it's a, yeah. And you know, one time I went to San Miguel to eat panes migueleños, and I remember I asked them, hey, do los panes migueleños don't understand? And they asked me, what? What is panes migueleños? Los panes migueleños, they're very famous. Donde hay. So yes. days later, I realized that in San Miguel, solo se llaman panes. They don't have panes migueleños. No, they're just called <laughs> because panes. Because you're in San Miguel. <laughs> yeah, because they sell in every corner, you know, just <laughs> panes. Oh, okay, these are the panes migueleños. No, it's just <laughs> some panes. Oh, okay. So then it made sense. Okay, los panes migueleños. <laughs> <laughs> I like San Miguel. I lived there like for two years. But, but well, it's very hot. Yeah. It's, it's, it's offensively hot. It's yes. very, very yes, hot. Yes. You can hear, I promise you, you can hear hot if you if you listen closely you hear you hear the the i i used to teach there and i remember that i had my my classroom full ac i never left my classroom and all my students they will they always ask me can you please turn off the ac so then then the next day <laughs> the next day I, I got the remote control and I put it in my desk and I said, oh, I'm sorry, there's no remote. Queda directo. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. I mean, like, really? You, <laughs> you want me to turn off the AC? You take a shower and when you're changing, you're sweating. Oh, yes. <laughs> yes. <laughs> One thing I also it's noticed, happened. I remember in San Miguel when you go to, like in San Salvador, mm -hmm. it's normal to have a fan, maybe, a fan. In San Miguel, mm -hmm. no importa la se va, but it's okay to have an air conditioning in your house. Really? Like, yeah, yeah, every, everybody has it. Was that your, Anna? Was, was that your? my neighbors. No, no, was that your Google translation? I heard. The weather in San Miguel is very hot. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. <laughs> okay, so is that a dog or a wolf? Yes. yes. That is scary. <laughs> I don't they know had, what. 
the boy. <laughs> if, yes, if that if that is not a dog, close your windows and doors. <laughs> okay, you know so what happened, in Moon? <laughs> yes. Okay, so we understand <laughs> unlike, right? Unlike is to say you're going to compare the with yes. something the totally opposite, and it's not necessary to explain. Correct. All right. So you don't need to explain because it's obvious of your explanation. Like Ricardo said, unlike San Miguel, the tortillas in San Salvador are very thick. So you don't need to explain, you don't need to say this. Unlike San Miguel, tortillas in San Salvador are very thick because in San Miguel they're very thin. You don't need to say that. You just said it with the explanation. Okay? okay. Next we have in contrast mm. to. It's like the opposite. The opposite. So unlike and in contrast to is pretty much the same. But the only difference, the only difference is, I mean, unlike and in contrast is that the two sides do the same thing, but differently. Like, let me see. Um, in contrast to, okay. And in um, the Arabic countries, they're very religious, right? Mm -hmm. And the Muslims, they're very big, yes? And in the rest of the world is mm -hmm. Christianism, yes? So the two, what do they have in common? That the two, the two parts are very religious. Yeah. But we can say in contrast to America, both like TV, except mm. that the typical Japanese person watches more of it. Italian and Japanese people are fairly... I'm sorry. I, I, I didn't know what time I pressed play. I was, who's speaking? <laughs> sorry. I, so, I thought it was Jordana. <laughs> the same. Yes, I promise you. I, I thought that too, but I thought it was Jordana too, and I was looking at her, but it's not her. <laughs> it's your uh, question. Yes. I remember a person told me uh, at the contrary. At the contrary, is okay or no? Is, is it the same in contrast? Yes, it's the in same. Contrast? It's the same. It's the same. Uh, how do you pronounce in contrast or in contrast? In contrast. Too. Contrast. Two. Contrast. Yes. Okay, thank you. So that means that the two parties do the same thing, but differently. When you say unlike, mm -hmm. is that one party does the one thing and the other one doesn't. So what I was mm -hmm. telling you is like, un uh, in contrast to Arabic countries, um, American, country, American countries practice Christianism. Yes, the majority, generally speaking, because I think there are some people in this country, in this continent that practice Muslims. But um, in contrast to Arabic people in America, they practice Christianism. So what am I saying in contrast? I'm saying that the two practice religion, but a different God. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Like, uh, like what Except it says here, like what it says here, in contrast to Italian drivers, Japanese drive on the left. So then it's saying the two drive, but in different sides. In different Exactly. Next we have use except that, except for, and except for the fact to show an exception, really? <laughs> Both like TV, except the typical Japanese person that watches, except that the typical Japanese per person watches more of it. 
Italians and Japanese people are fairly different, except for the age they get married. Get yes. Japanese and, typo and typical consume, I'm sorry, Japanese people typically consume less, except for the fact that they drink more tea. Drink more tea. Yes, um, Janita. Hi. Hi, teacher. Hi, Janita. Excuse me. I'm sorry. Are you married? No, I don't. Do you have a boyfriend? No, I don't. Oh, okay. Oh, I'm sorry. The, the reason why I was asking you is because I wanted you to give me an example with you and your husband or you and your boyfriend. You know, um, no. like, I don't like, have an example of that kind. Oh, okay. Okay, give me an example with you and your <laughs> sister. Your sister? Uh, for example, I we, like... Okay, um, oh, you know what? We you know like, what? Do you like we, the, same, the same type of men? Um, no. Okay, well, that's a good example. So you can say, my sister and I, we like men, except that... He likes this and I like that. that she prefers she prefers a slim man and I mm -hmm. prefer a little big man. <laughs> okay, all right, good. For me it's good when they are a little oh. fat. Chubby. Mm. Chubby. <laughs> really? Chubby. Why is that? That's 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 good. Because I think when we have have a man, it's it's for me, it's beautiful feel, uh, I don't know what you say, jiggly or gelatinositas. <laughs> I don't know, but I prefer, I prefer when those the are, man is, is a little fat. Those are called love handles. Love handles. <laughs> yes. Yeah. Do you know what love handles are? No. You know how I, I'm 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 gonna say women because men we don't care about this. They well, I mean we, we don't we don't really really care if we're getting fat or not. We do, but oh, we don't make a oh my god I'm dying. But you know how <laughs> women oh my god look me veo gorda and they and they pinch. Mira mira you know. Uh, yes. ¿Cómo se decimos eso en español? Mira tengo. Llantitas. Llantas. Okay, in, a, in English they're called they're called. Love handles. Love <laughs> yeah. Ah, okay. So men, we usually say no. Yes, man. I prefer that. Those are love handles. That's how I can hold you. <laughs> I can get you. <laughs> <laughs> mm -hmm. What is All the right. meaning in the Google translation? <laughs> love yeah. handles. I, I see Jordana <laughs> typing right now. We will get it. Yes. <laughs> I think. We will get the Google definition pretty quick, pretty soon. Yes, pretty <laughs> soon. Okay, okay. Oh, Jordana, give me an example with something that you have in common, but a little different between you and your husband. Mm, uh, let me see. So my husband and I, um, we both enjoy time with family, except that I rather to go out. I rather to go out, and he prefers to stay at home. Very good. All right, cool. You sound like my wife and I. <laughs> yeah. Okay, that's a very good example. Like. My wife and I, we both like rock music, except that she's more into like the indie rock and I'm more into like the good rock. <laughs> Classic, yeah. good. Yeah. Good. The but, 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 but yeah, the real rock. No, but I, but I do, I mean, there are some good indie, indie bands, but my wife thinks that Coldplay is rock, so. Hmm. No, no, yeah, but like my wife and I, we both like rock, except that she is more into indie. And I am more into like yeah. classic hard rock. But hard, you said hard that... rock, maybe. Mm -hmm. Yeah, yeah, yeah. ACDC, Deep Purple, Jimi Hendrix. 
and then classic normal bands. All right, um, Patty, give me an example. Mm. Let me see. Let me give you a. Let me give you a, an example, except for the fact. Mm -hmm. Except for the fact. Okay. okay. Le, this this esto se llama un negotiation. Mm. Ajá, cuando uno dice except for the fact, es como oh man, no va a pasar. Like, let's say you show me your car. Man, it's a very nice car. Imagine you're selling me your car and I like it in a way of it and everything. I tell you, man, I like the car. It's very good. Except for the fact that, boom. Yeah. Except for the fact that is standard and I, and I want automatic. Mm -hmm. Yes. I think cats are beautiful animals. I don't, no, example. I think that cats are beautiful animals, but I can't have them okay. except for the fact that they give me allergies, terrible allergies. Mm -hmm. That's why I hate them. Yeah. Um, in Centro, it's very beautiful, except for the fact that it's dangerous. <laughs> Yeah, but yes or no, when you go to downtown, you say, wow, it's beautiful. Wow, wow, wow. Y después, oh, man, hey, hey, mi cartera. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so listen, this is, this is, a, and, and I was, I was reading about this. They say Acapulco is very beautiful, except for the fact that now it's controlled by narcos. It's dangerous. For example, in San Salvador, every place is near, except for the fact the traffic is terrible. Yeah, exactly. There, there yeah. you go. Here's one for Jaime. Can be my sister and I both drives a car, mm -hmm. except for the fact that she only can automatic drive automatic. Okay, so that, that stops her from, from driving a standard card, right? Mm -hmm. Okay, good. So Jaime, listen to this example. Bukele is the coolest president in the world, <laughs> except for the fact uh -huh. that... <laughs> no, I'm joking. I'm joking. <laughs> I, I don't even know how to finish that. No, I'm joking. No, but um, that, that's a very good example. Everybody has given me a good example. But what I'm saying is that when you say, except for the fact that, that's what stops. Yes. Like, oh my God, I love this house. It's very beautiful, except for the fact that um, the window is too big and my son maybe can jump. Yes. This is beautiful house, mm -hmm. except, except for the fact that there is this big bus stop in front and it's full of people and it's very dirty. Have you been in a situation that you like something very much and everything is perfect, but there's one exception? That okay. exception, that exception would be except for the fact that. Like uh, Jordana, I would love to live in Ataco except for the fact that it's too far <laughs> and I have to work in San Salvador. Yes, that, so yes. that's when you use so except for the fact. Do you understand how to use it now? Yes. You know, like you can say, oh my God, I got a good job offer. Oh, really? And what happened? It was a very good offer, except for the fact that it's in La Union. Mm. And I, that means I have to live there and I can't because I live in San Salvador. And, and if I go and live over there, I have to buy a house, blah, 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 blah. So that stops you. That, that's, that's the only exception. 
is Salvador is playing excellent in this moment, except for the fact that they haven't played the big teams. <laughs> Mm. <laughs> yeah. Mexico Sunday, right? Sunday. Sunday. Yeah. Really? What the hell? What is that? That's a duck. What happened here? Oh, with the, 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 the dog. Dog. Hey, what <laughs> happened here with your, your duck? No, I think it was Eduardo. Mm. You know, Eduardo could say, that sounds sorry, like sorry, a... sorry. No, it's okay. What, what, do, uh, do, do you hear me now? Yes, I can. Okay, Your dog yeah. also. What, yeah. What's my dog? <laughs> All is oh. silence except for the fact in the house. In the house. Wait, wait. Listen to this. <laughs> if Eduardo wants to scare us, he can say, I think that's a dog, except for the fact that I don't have a dog. He barked like a wolf. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, can, can you imagine? That's a scary story. Imagine we're in Eduardo's house and we hear wolf. What is that? And Eduardo, I think that's a dog, except for the fact that I don't have a dog. And there are no dogs in this house. <laughs> Who is that? Oh, that's an old lady. She looks like my I grandmother. Like the animals, except for the fact that dogs, no, it's good except for dogs, right? But but um, you have to. I could say like I like animals or I like pets, except me to clean their mess. Yes, you have to give an excuse in this case, Madeline. Like, okay, you said I like all animals except dogs. Oh, man. <laughs>